and I hope there is no one here in this room who is a student who is not already a geography major. <laughs> Just in case, I will try to persuade you that becoming a geography major might be the best thing you ever did in with your life. It was the best thing that ever happened to me. But let me try to prove that to you uh, in a half an hour or so with some background about what we geographers do. Let me let me just let me just tell you that for those of you who are not geographers, how we geographers look at the world. In fact, all of you will have known enough about the way uh, scholars look at the world to realize there are really three three principal ways you can approach the comp this complex world of ours, the human world of ours. One is uh, the historic way, that is uh, time, chronology, and historians' key question is where. And uh, historians have made a huge success in our country of uh, proving to the population how important they are. Every time we geographers turn on television, there is some presidential historian talking about a past president, or some historian commenting on Iraq, or some historian telling us why we're on the wrong track with China. Historians have, if you walk into a bookstore, there's liable to be a special section for history. You're not liable to find one for geography, but the historians have done very well. And we are actually, as far as I'm concerned, chronology obsessed. We talk about history, not only in history, but in paleontology, in archeology, span in, uh, in, in, in economics, in political science, you name it. History seems to be a key item. Uh, we geographers feel sort of in, in, in second place. Well, there is a second way to look at the world, and that is what let's call it structurally. You know, the, the way the way systems uh, are organized. Uh, political scientists, economists look at the way look at the world that way. And then there is a third way, and that is to ask the question where. That is, when things happen, is it the location? key. And so geographers' issues relate to where, to spatial matters. We use the word spatial a lot. And so when we uh, see a problem arising, whether it is uh, uh, starting a war in a country or negotiating whether we should be selling uh, our um, port facilities or allowing a foreign country to run our port facilities, the first thing we geographers do is look at the, look at the map. And so the map is our big ally, and I'm going to draw some of the worst maps you've ever seen on this whiteboard behind me in a few moments.